And all out in this matchup. Things are about to go from bad to worse. Oh my God. No. Ooh, right to the face. That's what he was looking for. Six-man tag matches oh, always have a million things happening at once. Add seen Carl launching himself in the air to that equation, and you have complete and utter chaos. Oh, man. Oh, right to the arm. Hyper-extend your elbow. What a stomp. Good grief. Beautiful technique. Oof. Tag. What's going to happen here? Drop kick with precision. Big time slam. Vicious. Elbow drop, big time! Oh man, oh, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. He's on the defensive here. He may have to start reevaluating his game plan. You know, there's an art wow. to being a successful tag team competitor. And right now, he resembles more of a finger paint. Jumping, leaping attack. In 2016, the New Day found themselves in the middle of a sick and twisted rivalry with the Wyatt family. Things escalated to the point where Bray Wyatt invited the New Day to do battle at the Wyatt family compound. New Day accepted, but what followed was something no one expected or will ever be able to forget. Oh, what a clothesline. Forcefully delivered. Corey, we've talked about six-man tag matches, and earlier you talked about one that caught the attention of the entire sports entertainment world. The New Day fought for survival amongst the darkness of the Wyatt family compound in a battle where pickaxes and cinder blocks were used as weapons and automobiles were used as battering rams. Ray Mysterio, thunderous slam. Here's his chance. We discussed John Cena's injuries earlier, and Byron, I'm wondering, how would you target them? Well, I'm too honorable personally to attack injuries, but if I was meaner, I'd stop the tricep he tore against Daniel Bryan at Summers. Here he goes. Slam down hard. This is all but over. The Rock. Got every ounce of that one. This made The Rock a billion-dollar man in Hollywood. Michael, Corey, you both discussed The Rock's dominance on the big screen, and I have to point out that he brought his start on full circle when he actually produced a movie about Paige's career. Yeah, I actually caught an advanced screening of the movie and loved every minute of it, but if The Rock oh, wants man. another great WWE story, how about the inspirational tale of how I became the greatest announcer in WWE history despite being held back by working with you, Byron. Over time, there have been various types of six-man teams that have been successful. There are family trios like the Guerreros, the Grams, the Andersons, and the Von Erichs. There have been members. Orton looking for an RKO. Here's his moment, Michael. Randy Orton climbing up. Look at this. Byron, you mentioned some families and groups that created incredible six-man teams. Talking more about factions. Don't forget about the likes of the Hart Foundation, Evolution, Ouch. the Wyatt Family, the Shield, and the New Day. These are only some of the trios who've had... Uh-oh, Cole, I think we know what the Viper's doing. Yeah, Randy Orton was in position. Good night. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. I don't know if The Undertaker can recover. And tagged in as The Rock. The Undertaker has been a boxing and mixed martial arts enthusiast for decades. 
You can see the influence those disciplines have had on the Phenom Jeez. in the way he pummels his opponents when he's competing in a WWE ring. It's difficult to choose which is more lethal, the dead man's strikes or his submission moves. Boom, what impact! And if he hits this, oh, what a slam. This one's over, guys. The Rock is rolling now. The Phenom has been seen in the crowd at many high-profile championship matches in boxing and mixed martial arts. It was in the early 2000s when Undertaker began to incorporate elements of the sweet science in the octagon into his offensive arsenal. Yeah, as if The Undertaker wasn't intimidating enough. You know someone has a pack. Uh-oh. Going for the run. Massive choke slam. Now it's time to capitalize. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Oh, boy, he is rolling. There are times during a six-man tag match where the hostility between two teams overflows. The result is Rey Mysterio looking for something big. Superplex! Wow, we might just be witnessing the end of The Undertaker. Uh-oh, here we go, here we go! Byron, you talked about the moment in six-man tag matches when all semblance of order breaks down. Counter here, dodges that one. And Rey Mysterio says, not this time. Now step up in Zagiri. Rocked him. Oh boy, he is rolling. Oof. Ah, jumpy DDT. My. Oof. Wow, we might just be witnessing the end of The Undertaker. Rey Mysterio looking for something big. Oh, nasty impact. Wow, we might just be witnessing the end of The Undertaker. You gotta believe this one's over. Ladies and gentlemen, Rey Mysterio's exploits in WWE have been well documented. But let's not forget, Mysterio was also quite successful in WCW prior to the company being sold in 2001. I'll destroy your face. What a stomp. Good grief. To illustrate just how successful Mysterio was in WCW, as Michael stated, in addition to capturing the Cruiserweight and Tag Team Championships, Mysterio was also one half of the WCW oh. Cruiserweight Tag Team Champions. Yeah, but let's be honest, with the WCW Cruiserweight Tags, Rey Mysterio slammed with authority. That has got to be it. The force of that impact should put an end to this match right here. The Rock tagged in. There are instances when a six-man tag match will feature a team where superstars have not always seen eye to eye or are in the midst of a disagreement. When that's the case, someone on the team... Oh, my goodness! Hoopstone pile driver! Well, there's only one thing left to say, guys. There's a pin now. Very curious move to go for a pinfall at this... Really, Luchador hits the ring. Uh -oh. The oh, oh my goodness, crushing it. Standing drop kick. Great ups. Sin Cara showing signs that it could be ending soon. We've seen Sin Cara earn unbelievable victories over much larger opponents. Just take a look at the faceless one's victories over the likes of Titus O'Neil Rusev and the bitter rival, the lone wolf, Baron Corbin. The faceless one's capable of so many amazing maneuvers from the top rope, it's hard to keep track of all of them. You should be grateful that I'm here to do that for you. Irish whip. Oh, the old head scissor. Something that is always important in a six-man match is having the ability to perform double-team moves. One of the things that successful six-man teams try and execute are double-team moves and then have the third team member perform a signature or finishing maneuver to deliver maximum impact 
to an opponent. Like oh, 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 we know what's coming next. Oh, boy, do we ever. That might have grounded Sin Cara for good. Teamwork is always paramount in a six-man tag match. Superstars want to be able to have a level of teamwork where two members of the trio perform a double-team move, and the third member follows that up with a move so their opponent is really down for the count. The key is to deliver the maximum amount of punishment to your opponent in the least amount of time. You have until the referee... These superstars going all out in this matchup. Things are about to go from bad to worse. Oh, my God. No. Ooh, right to the face. That's what he was looking for, Michael. Six-man tag team matches have been a staple of competition since the early days of sports entertainment. Two teams of three compete against one another under traditional tag team rules. Stipulations can be added, like no disqualification. One more look at it. Spinebuster. That might have grounded Sin Cara for good. He's making a statement here with this attack. Get ready, Corey. Get ready for the most electrifying move in all of sports entertainment. The people's elbow. That might have grounded Sin Cara for good. This is The Rock's chance. Can he pull it off? Down to the floor. Both teams working well here together. That's not always the case in a six-man tag team match. Oftentimes, you'll see personal agendas eat their way into the action. So close, just a little. And he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. Wow, I thought he was a goner. Oh boy, he is rolling. Right, here we go. Here comes The Rock. We know what's coming here. Spine Buster. I don't know. Is that enough to stop Cena? What a slam, Michael. Rock setting it up. The Rock with a rock bottom. That should do it. With the tag is Randy Orton. Uh-oh, he's in trouble here. Uh-oh, watch out. Cena's got him up. Attitude adjustment. Are we looking at yet another John Cena victory here? Cover here. One. Nailed it. Randy Orton, no problem in getting out of that one. Success breeds success, and he's definitely having some right now. Vintage Randy Orton. This one is over. The Rocket with the tag. He's lining him up. He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his salt ever does. The Rock is in serious peril. Is there anything that can be done to get back to being a threat? His hopes of winning this match appear to be dwindling in a hurry. To be successful, the offensive style he's relying on tonight requires he not lose too much stamina. But by the looks of things right now, he might need a new game plan. Man, he was making it look easy there for a moment, which is pretty impressive considering who he's in the ring with. Ooh, this might be it. Oh, my. Harsh impact. Somebody got hops. The Rock gets inside. Close this thing out. 
STF applied. Are we looking at yet another John Cena victory here? Oh man, The Rock really needs to dig down deep. When this guy's on, look out. The Rock turns it around. John Cena with a nice reversal. There may be no coming back from this incredible beatdown. He might have it. Rock bottom, the rock bottom. Game, set, match. This one is over. Gets the tag. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Rey Mysterio looking for something big. Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh no, Sunset Bomb, wow. Now the old vicious head crank. Look at the torque. It might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. And Rey Mysterio says, not this time. Oh, and he makes the tag. That was a game changer right there, Michael. And that one drops him. Somebody's on a mission tonight. Oh boy, he is rolling. He's looking at it. Is he done? Nice job breaking out of that one. But there's plenty more work for him to do here. The Undertaker knows every game there is, including mind games. Ooh, what impact. He could pin his opponent right here. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Back breaker. Oh, no, he's taken down. You know, I don't think he has much left. Randy Orton feeling good about himself right now. Oh, he's able to reverse it. Boom! <laughs> Harsh impact. Close line! Well, that'll leave a mark. Oh, he's almost... There it is, the tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. Boom, what impact! Randy Orton's in a world of hurt! And the Viper needs to rally quick. And his chances of winning the counter here. And Randy Orton just slips out of harm's way. Success breeds success, and he's definitely having some right now. This is not the place where you want to underestimate your competition. Absolutely not. Oh no, RKO out of nowhere! That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. Orton better not waste this opportunity. Big move, and RKO! Just when you thought he had... He goes for the cover. The Rock was just one step off the cover. Backbreaker flawlessly executed. This is going to be bad for Sin Cara. And there's the cover. One, two, three. What a six-man tag match. That match is worth another look. Here we go. I can watch highlights of that one all night long. One of the great WWE matches I've ever been able to watch. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Epic. Randy Orton puts the finishing touches on this one for the win.
when you bring such a high level of intensity to the match, good things are bound to happen to you. As hard as it will be not to think about I just want to dance all night, forget my problems, I might go insane. I don't really give a damn what they say, and now you know, now you know it. Hey, little lady said you feel the same, but I don't believe a word you say, cause I don't think you're here to stay. I don't think you're here to stay So tell me what you want Tell me how you want it Tell me all the reasons that you're